Hello everyone, this is Moshe the Electric Israeli and thank you for joining my channel. If you're new, please subscribe and help me change the world one electric car at a time. Thank you to all my patrons and those who ordered a Tesla using my link. And today we're going to talk about Model Y, the very much anticipated uh, Tesla Model Y. And I'm going to prove to you proof of concept that Model Y is going to kick some serious butt in uh, the segment of small SUVs once it's coming out and what it's what it's sold and it's not only going to beat all the other EV equivalents but it's also going to beat uh, gasoline equivalents such as um, Toyota RAV4 the CRV and all of those and how do I know that and it's very simple uh, always always uh, tesla haters and tesla opponents talk about competition oh tesla's gonna have competition and they're gonna lose a lot of market share okay so let's take a look let's let's see who has a, a all electric uh a small suvs and how they're doing so far so let's play a little word association so if i say and this is for people who love cars like i do if you say the word Ford, what's the first thing that comes to your mind? To me, Ford F-150, it's like their flagship. Uh, Ford Mustang, I used to have a Ford Mustang. Wonderful, amazing, Gus Gessler. <laughs> uh, let's take a look, uh, Mercedes. You're never going to name Mercedes with some kind of uh, electric car. You're going to say Mercedes, uh, you know, uh, Ford Matrix, uh, Mercedes Benz, Mercedes, whatever that is that comes up to you. You're not going to say uh, something uh, having to do with electric. Let's take a better one. BMW. You say BMW uh, 3 Series, 5 Series, Audi, Audi uh, X5. You're not going to say Audi e-tron or Audi uh, i3 uh, or, or BMW i3. If you are not an EV person, you will associate it with gasoline more. You go to any dealership parking lot, anyone, Chevy, Ford, BMW, Mercedes, Nissan, you name them, all of them. What do you see on the lot? You see any electric cars? Do they put them up front? Do they try to sell them? The answer is no. So no gasoline uh, 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 car company is going to compete uh, with uh, Tesla Model Y, just like they don't compete with Tesla Model 3. Just like Tesla Model 3 outselling the luxury segments altogether, that's why. Because that's not what they try to do, because it's, Tesla is a great product. So let's take a look, even now, there are, there are small electric SUVs but they sell pitifully, pitiful sales. The all new Tesla killer, uh, um, uh, Audi uh, e-tron, they sell little, tiny bit, you barely know. Uh, the um, uh, Hyundai Kona, okay, the Kia Soul EV, uh, and on and on. Those are considered to be small SUVs, but they don't sell. They don't sell because you don't find them. You go there, you don't know. You, you, nobody's trying to sell them to you. They don't advertise them. They don't try to put them out. They do not sell. I'll give you one more example, and that would be the best illustrator. I remember when the Chevy Bolt with a B, Chevy Bolt EV came out. And the Chevy Bolt is actually a very nice car. Very nice, very expensive, but very nice car. And um, it came more than a year. It was unsaid more than a year than the Tesla Model 3, okay? The Tesla Model 3, as of now, selling not tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands. Hundreds of thousands. They sell 15, sometimes 20, sometimes 25,000 uh, 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 cars uh, in a quarter or, or in a month. Just, let's say in the United States, as opposed to uh, the Bolt and everybody else who sells very little. So what I'm trying to tell you is that when you say the word Tesla, you don't associate it with any gasoline. That's not what they do. They have such a reputation of excellence that I am confident, 100% confident, that the Tesla Model Y is going to be such great success and it's going to outsell everybody, not only the EV equivalents, 
but also the uh, gasoline equivalents. You you see, you I mark my word. Okay, w let me know what you think. Do you agree, disagree? Put your comments below. Thank you for watching. Give me a thumbs up. See you tomorrow.